Spring County Jail holds more than 50 inmates, and the sheriff says it is currently at full capacity. Thanks for joining us at 6. I'm Laura Monteverdi. Hello, good evening. I'm Bob Clausen. The sheriff says the department is racking up felony arrest and has made over 500 traffic stops just in the last few months. Talisa Hampton joining us live from the county jail there. And Talisa, the sheriff, what are they trying to do now to deal with overcrowding? They're doing these traffic stops, making these arrests. Where are they putting these people? Yeah, Bob and Laura, the Hot Springs County Sheriff says their jail is at full capacity and they've been doing everything they can to think of. Now they tell me that they've been trying to transfer some inmates and going to their last resort, which would be releasing some with low crimes. He says he wants to ensure the community's safety and says they are not taking this lightly. Josh Casso was in shock to learn the Hot Spring County Jail is full. It doesn't surprise me. It is kind of a smaller jail. Sheriff Scott Finkbeiner says the jail only holds one fifth of their population. We're going to have to release people sometimes that we don't want to release. Uh, that stolen property and things like that. Seeing the crime shift. We have conducted around 600 traffic stops. Finkbinder says they're at capacity with 55 inmates being housed, releasing some to make room for violent criminals. We have child molesters, we have, you know, murderers in the jail. Um, you obviously can't release them. The decision on who gets released depends on a certain criteria and approved by department officials. We can't really hold misdemeanors at least for very long because uh, we have violent felons. Finkbinder says they managed to move 15 inmates to other county jails, but it was difficult. I'd say most jails in the state of Arkansas are at capacity. Finkbinder says they're trying to get a larger jail along with more resources. We have ordered radar units um, for our vehicles. We've ordered uh, some tasers, some newer tasers that are better. Um, we're also in the process of uh, taking, doing bids for body cams. Cassaw works and lives down the street from the county jail. He believes everyone deserves a second chance. As long as they're not out causing issues, I mean, I don't see the problem with it. Now, the sheriff also says they have at least 100 people in the county right now out on a felony warrant, but they cannot take them to jail because they're at full capacity. He says it's an issue he hopes to get resolved soon. Reporting in Hot Spring County, I'm Talisa Hampton. Back to you.